my god, we're the same height for once in his life. Because I'm sat back and you're on your knees. <laughs> yeah, that's actually bad, isn't it? <laughs> right. Left. <laughs> Probably didn't expect to see my face on YouTube because I ghosted my channel for like three months, but we're here, we're in Liverpool, and we're bringing you a big fat cosy Christmas vlog. We decided to come back again this year because obviously we couldn't last year because of all the shite and big fat Boris. But yeah, we've come back this year, we're coming to the Christmas market, which we've never done in Liverpool before. The last video of this did really well, so I thought we'd vlog it again for your enjoyment, entertainment, I hope, anyways. It's also good for us to watch back just for like memories and stuff because the amount of times we've rewatched the one from a couple of years ago. I mean, I know it's not sad saying I watch my own videos back, but like no, vlogs do. that we do you, together, you, you I, you I watch enjoy Paris watching back. Like, um, <laughs> Paris has got like 100k views and yours is about 90k. <laughs> so you've contributed. But yeah, we're just going to bring you along. I'll quickly show you a tour of the room because it's different to the one we stayed in last time. We hope you enjoy. Everyone always asks for vlogs, so this and we never do anything should hopefully be somewhat know. entertaining for you. So we're going to get prepared it's now five to four probably jump in the shower get herself sorted and then christmas jump in market. an uber to the christmas market bring you along and then hopefully it isn't disappointing yeah if it is because we're staying over we'll just get some alcohol no it, sh it shouldn't be just you know the only one we've ever been to is leeds and that was about six stalls and we walked around and went home yeah basically just want to do a little bit of last minute shopping i say last minute i've barely bought anything and just enjoy the festive feels and just take advantage of the fact that we're staying over somewhere so that we can actually drink because we rarely drink together unless it's like new year's which is in a couple of weeks but yeah we're gonna stop rambling and we're gonna crack on with this video enjoy <laughs> I'm a bit of a nip on before we go out because I didn't do any this morning and I kind of hope that my lash extensions would suffice for me looking ugly but they don't so I'm gonna have to whack something on to look slightly more presentable so I whack on a bit of this CRA watermelon burst hydrating primer basically any sort of liquidy thing I can shove on my face because I've actually forgot to bring moisturiser so I'm hoping this is gonna make do the foundation I use I'm mostly oh my god I've got a moisturiser should I do that? Have a simple hydrating booster. Everything's going on my face in the wrong order, but as long as it's on there, it's fine. As I was saying, I use the Ordinary Coverage Foundation. The pump does work, but I just prefer to use the little stick thing. And just blend it in. Just give me more of a even tone. Blend it down my neck. I have not been sleeping, and you can really tell. Just let it seep into my skin. I'll blend this out. And then I won't be right there. I'm not good at this. Anyways, powder. This I've probably had about three years, which is so grim because I'm pretty sure it only lasts like 12 months. And I usually do put it on the sponge and I've not brought one with me, so we're gonna improvise and use the brush I use to dust it off my face, to put it on my face. I'm just gonna lightly set the absolute chaos that is currently sitting on my face. Paul Jack's sat in there dying for me to hurry up, but I'm gonna quickly pop on some bronzer. This is fresh beige. I mix, even though it's a face powder. Match my neck to my face and kind of morph everything together, I guess. I'm going to use some Too Faced Lip Plumper instead, which means Jack can't kiss me. And it's really going to hurt, but my lips look glossy, so. Five minutes. I've already lost my headband. Although I think that fell off in the hotel, so we'll see when we go back if it's on the floor anywhere. But we've been and got a what is it called? Triple chicken grill box. Yeah. 
from one of the stands where it's like three different types of chicken on noodles with like barbecue sriracha and garlic mayo. Absolutely beautiful. But I was going to walk around and try bits and bobs from different stalls and just fill myself up on good food. Amy wants a large Frank photo. I also need to clean my lens because it's absolutely sogging. But yeah, we're just going to walk around. We've purposely not got tea because we're coming to have bits and bobs. But everything just looks so pretty. Like, look at all the twinkly lights. Sisters. I sucked the wrong bit. Huh? Oh, your noodles are all chocked. Okay, come on. Come down to veggie noodles. Sorry if you keep getting splashed. Can't really help it. And this one don't fit either. The weather conditions are not this deep. It does not cooperate. I've also got the worst oh. shoes to wear when it's wet. Because, um. You want to try a vegan sausage? I've got plenty of eggs on. Right, we've got a big fat German sausage. I'm thinking it's going to be like a hot dog, but it's actually a big fat sausage. So She only likes burnt sausages that are crispy. Yeah, and this is very like undercooked for me. Try from the other side. Get the full on No, because it's going to pop in my mouth and I don't want it to. Oh, it just looks so slimy. Right, fucking hell. Oh, it doesn't taste horrible. It tastes like inside of a good sausage roll. Is at the end, it's like a chewy. Oh. Who's you tried it? I know what you like, you wouldn't have tried that usually. £6.50 for a soggy sausage. And she has one at home. <laughs> I don't know if you can actually see how bad the rain is behind us, but it took us about 25 minutes to find a shelter, and we've just got one. And the back of me is kind of still getting wet. My eyelashes are destroyed, but it's all part of the fun, isn't it? Although I'm very excited to sleep in a comfy bed tonight. I'm so tempted to go on an electric scooter, but I know I'm going to absolutely deck it and swallow my ass. So it's not even worth it. If it were dry, fair enough. Yeah. I don't know, it'll, it'll slip when it's wet. It's not even raining, it's like... Boring. It costs like three pounds to get a hot chocolate. I'm not spending another three pounds to put two drops of Baileys in it. Yeah, we're getting pissed. We get you wavy and it's a one-off. We're not going to be able to do... We've tried doing this for the past two years and yeah, it's failed true. every time, right? <laughs> We might as well. Come on. Go all out. Come on. Right, let's get go get some. Chucky Baileys. Oh, cheers. I've got my Baileys got chocolate and I'm so excited. I'm also got probably taking my hood down. down. Because I look ridiculous in my hood up, but it's very hot as you can see. Oh, it's probably not even that hot. It's probably just freezing outside. Would you, would you be mad if it's very Baileys? No, I kind of want it to be because of how much I just paid for it. Christmas markets. Oh, they're extortionate. They're worth but... it. Well, because it's a one off. It's a once a year thing, isn't it? Well, if these fuckers come like twice a week, then. Yeah, you're not going to come every day in December. I was really not going to burn my tongue. Ooh, oh my god, I've got a little. Oh, it tastes like a, like a Bailey's truffle. Plastic. It's almost yeah. like a creamy, creamy hot chocolate. Ooh! You like such a dickhead lad when I say that. Oh, it gets me so excited for Christmas now, like Bailey's. Ah! Love Bailey's. Oh, it's probably not wise of me to have this after hot chocolate, but I'm just going to sip of it. Oh, that's not even bad. No, I'm at this stage, I can't step up to like Budweiser's and Stella's and all that. I think we're grim. I feel like if someone didn't have like cocktails or the option of a sweet, I'd be able to drink. I'm at the, I'm at the pussy Desperados. stage of Coronas and Desperados. Tequila. Ah, oh, she's so good. Uh, okay, up there, I'm sorry. <laughs> I hope to God you can hear us. I'm trying, there's so much going on. We'll add subtitles. Oh, that's actually a good idea, yeah. And then Amy can do both of our voices when we get home and she edits it. <laughs> the hamstrings are burning, so I've got to bend down to the camera. Sorry, problems of having a short girlfriend. It's not even that, because that's very high. We're going to see how much the wheel is. Yeah, I've never been on a wheel. But, because it's raining, the it's carriages... It's not great. Yeah, there's walls and a roof. Well, the walls aren't connected to the roof. This is no side. Yeah, we'll get put on the dodgy bit. And then once we go on it, it'll probably break down, like in every film. Is it worth risking it? Or do we buy more food? Oh, please have a sip of that. Not Come on, that. I was a grown-up and I had a sip of your beer. You're yeah. the grown-up. You're the grown-up. Um, yeah, I'm older than you. What do you mean, look at me? Look at her. Dressed up like when a mum got on the sun to get cold in winter. Yeah, well, I did have a headband on, but... It's fucked off somewhere. Jack looks your child. Oh, a bit oh. of Prince. Do, 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 do. So what have we had? Chicken. Chicken and noodles. Banging. 
beautiful. I'd eat that again. We had two rows, but we were too hungry to film it, and we had nowhere to stand in the shelter to film, so we just scoffed them down. The caramel sauce for that was, oh my god, I could just take a bath in it. Then we got the hot dog thing, which he loved when I was a bit, and then. Me up chucky. But I kind of want something savoury again now because I didn't eat that hot dog. But I don't know what else. What savoury that you like because you, all you want is crepes, waffles, donuts. Do you know I what think I mean? the Yorkshire pud wrap would be a bit too much for me. I'd get like three bites in and then. Yorkshire. I don't know what that stand is that says the Greek. I'm guessing it's all Greek food. Fucking Einstein here, Bush. Anyways, we're going to finish our drinks and we'll catch up with you when we decide what we're doing next. On the flippity doo. The camera's drowning. Yeah. It's so good. We're gonna call it a wrap for the Christmas markets. We just got some popcorn for Jack and I got myself a bag of candy floss to bring back to the hotel. I'm probably gonna go over in a nice hot bath and just chill and watch Netflix on the laptop or something and just have a cozy night in, maybe some Christmas films, but this was actually probably one of the best, I mean, say probably one of the best, it's probably the only. Well, we're meant to go to Edinburgh, so I think Edinburgh's a bit better than this, but this is very good yeah. from what we've experienced. It's one of the best ones we've been to, although we've only been to Leeds, so we've not really got much to compare it to, but. Hopefully next year we can do bigger and better and go to Edinburgh, but for now, it's been bloody great. So we're just going to book an Uber and head back to the Titanic. Out the bath and in my new gym jams. How cute are these? They're from Cider and they've got like loads of little red strawberries all over them in kind of like a woven ribbed detail. I don't know if you can see, it's like really cutely detailed. Anyway, I've had to tie it a lot because of my lack of boobage, but like the shorts fit so nice. It's so pretty. My hair's still looking really wild because I forgot to mention we are going back to the Maya Wellness Spa tomorrow morning. So I didn't want to wash my hair and then have to rewash it after it being in like the hot chlorine water. But I'm so excited for like the heated pool and the big long robes and just two hours of chill in a nice hot spa. So got that to look forward to. But for now, I'm gonna pop on a face mask and try to convince Jack to do so. I don't know if he will, but fingers crossed. And then get in bed and watch some Netflix with some candy floss because I've still got a full bag in the bedroom. Change of plan. I'm not doing no face muscle while watching Netflix because Jack decided to go to bed. So I'm gonna eat candy floss by myself. <laughs> <laughs> well, you don't leave me much choice, do you? Then you said, oh, I'll do the face mask with you in bed. And then you decided, oh, fuck it, I'm not doing it at all. <laughs> so now I'm by myself while he falls asleep. You should do the same, otherwise, not gonna wake up in the morning. I have to be responsible. Live life on the edge. I am currently on the edge of the fucking bed with you. So yeah, I'm gonna sulk and go to bed now. If this is the end of the video, this is the end of the video. <laughs> if not, I'll see you in the morning at the spa with this dickhead. Morning. Morning from the two people who barely made it up in time to get down to the spa. We booked it for eight. We woke up at five to, so we were in a bit of a rush to put our swimming stuff on and head down there, but we did we did make it in time. We booked two hours, but only stayed there for one because there's only so much you can do and we kind of just needed to come back up and pack. So that's what we've just done and we're about to go get some breakfast and go home. But the spa is always so nice, hence why we now look like this. Because sure it's yeah. like the most <laughs> relaxing thing and then you just come back and you just feel like I go to bed. I think if we ever come here again we'll probably try to do the spa on a night because we've only ever done it like really early in the morning and it's just a lot of stress to get up at that time. Well it is for me anyway, it's probably not for you. But we're going to get some food and head out. I'll do a quick out for the day in the bathroom one last time because I'm going to miss that bathroom so much. <sighs> and Jack's going to leave. Ah, 
Paige, what are you phone? So you can watch TikToks. Bing bong. But I will <sighs> quickly. Oh God, look how steamy everything is because of the shower. Show you a little outfit of the day before we go. Fucking hell, it is bright. <laughs> I shut this door because it kind of gets in the way. Ruins the vibe. But anyways, it's going to be a little flippity flip. We have on. God, just ignore all the mess. This little top from Zara. It's like a <coughs> it's like a Zara really Basque nude little crop top. These leggings I got from Depop, but I'm pretty sure the the ones from that Shein set. You know, it's like comes with the white and the brown and the whatever for colour. It's a little bit see through, but I have put nude underwear on, so hopefully you can't see. And then I have this really long cardigan on from Elle's Bell's Boutique, which I bought it from her TikTok live, but she does have like an actual clothing page and then I have all my standard jewellery on this little pearl necklaces by Meshik these are cider and then these are just like little Primark studs and I look like I've just been cast for like flushed away or something I look like a little rat but I'm gonna put my scarf on get my bag get my shoes on and be good to go but I just want to say farewell to this lovely bathroom I'm gonna miss it so much like the lighting it's <sighs> dreaming let's go get some breakfast and go. Hi, can I take your order? Uh, can we get one sausage and egg McMuffin, please? Yeah, anything else? Uh, two ash browns. Yeah. And then uh, a double sausage and egg McMuffin meal with uh, water. Yeah. And then a cheesy bacon flatbread and that's it, Tom. Can you have one please? Cheers, man. Yeah. Cheers. Yeah. Yeah. Did you not ask for a walk? I don't care, <laughs> We made it back and someone's very excited to see us. Hi darling! Excited! I love how I just pause it as soon as I press go on the camera, Act it just like goes all shy. Yeah. <gasps> Thank you, Susan. <gasps> Why has he gone so shy? Do you never want us to go again? <gasps> What's Jack got? What's he got? <gasps> <laughs> Rue, come, come here. Come sit here. Come sit here. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that is the end of this little liverpool christmas vlog whatever you call it if you did enjoy it and want to see more like this do let me know because i've actually quite enjoyed filming this vlog i don't usually <laughs> vlog that often because i'm mostly just in the house but it's been nice to actually do something and bring my camera along so with that being said i'm gonna love you and leave you and see you in some more festive videos to come soon bye say bye Rue. come here say bye Hey, Paul. Say bye, everybody. S O S, never guess, cause I know Mama told me that I'm blessed, but he never wanna show. Get impressed, cause I'm dope. You don't smoke, what you mean? Keep it potent as the green, so you know this happy tree.